part of the process of teaching myself to work was that I'd made up movies on the back of my eyelids long before I ever shot them. Uh, and that by the time I was in graduate school, I could run on an entire movie in, the, in my head and see it shot for shot. Jan Kadar, I worked for for two years while I was at the American Film Institute. He used to like test me on it. He'd give me a, a Fellini movie, some, some really complicated movie, complicated European movie, and he'd say, go learn it. Now by that he meant, he didn't mean, you know, tell him what the plot was. He meant, learn the movie. And he tests me by having me sit, he sit me in a, at a desk, give me a pile of paper and say, okay, write down the shots. Not some of the shots, not what were the memorable moments. No, every shot in the movie, shot for shot, in sequence, where it was, what, you know, basically was it a dolly or a close up of the girl or whatever. If I had wanted to be a violinist or something, I would have, you know, good musicians have hundreds of scores right in their head. Um, they don't need to read the sheet music, they know it. They have, if you study at that level, you would need to know, um, you'd need to know music that intensely or that closely. Um, Part of my training, they just, um, Jan tried to insist that, um, that I'd have to learn to deal with pictures that intensely, um, so that I'd live in a world of pictures, um, and how pictures are arrived at, and what is the sequence of pictures, so that I didn't really need to write out storyboards of what's the movie look like. Um, what you need storyboards for are to communicate with other people about a specific picture, particularly if you're doing a movie that has special effects. You have to storyboard those. You have to do a drawing of what's the shot supposed to look like. So, because you need to discuss at great length and probably with lawyers and all sorts of nonsense you have to work out a contract for how much will it cost to do this picture so the more specific you are the better it works and that you storyboard for um, storyboarding to just you know um, try to figure out what the movie's supposed to look like or something is you know, it's a little silly